In this video series, we're going to be covering sharing in 12D model. The process of sharing in 12D model involves referencing models and tins from one project into another, with the data linked to the original project. Data shared into a second project can be viewed, referenced, or inquired, but cannot be edited. Shared data can only be edited or changed in the original 12D model project. A common way to share data from one 12D model project to another is to share survey project data into a design project. In this case, the survey project is called the server project and the design project is called the client project. The server project has models and tins shared and the client project references or shares in models and tins from the server project. When the shared data is changed in the server project, the next time the client project is synchronized or reopened, the data will update to reflect these changes. Now jumping into 12D model, in the plan view here, if I select the minus button, you'll see I have all of the models that I want to share out of this server project. And in the perspective view, I have the one tin that we want to share out of this server project. Uh, so to share these models and tins out, we can go to project, sharing, manage, or through the sharing toolbar, uh, the first icon here, which is share management. So we'll go ahead and click that. Now when we select this project, we get a full list of all the models inside this project which are available to be shared out. So we want to share out all of the models and tins in this project. Uh, so to avoid ticking on each of these tick boxes individually, we'll just click on share and right click and select tick and that will tick on all of the models for us. Uh, we're just going to untick tin survey because when we share out the tin uh, separately, that's going to create a model for us. Uh, we also have a share as, so we can uh, define a specific model that we want to share this model out as if we want it to be different to what it's currently called in the project. Uh, but we're going to leave all of these as they are and select set. And then in the tins tab, we're just going to share out our one tin and select set and then finish. Uh, we can confirm that these models and tins have been shared out and again by selecting the minus button and we can see that the models in the model list have now turned orange which is the default color for when a, pr for when a model is available or has been shared out. Uh, similarly in the perspective view we can see that our tin survey has also turned orange which means it has been shared out of this project. Just run a project save. And then I'll jump into the client project, which I've set up previously, which in this case is a road design project. Uh, to share the data into the client project, which has been shared out of the server project, uh, we can go to project sharing manage, or we can use the sharing toolbar again and select share management. Uh, we'll select new project and under the folder we'll browse to the survey project which has been set up. Select set and then in the models tab we can see all of the available models uh, for sharing into this project. Uh, we're going to select the share column and right click and select tick. Uh, now we can share the model names in as something different uh, to the source if we'd like to, or we can use the search and replace feature at the bottom of the panel. Now we're just going to search for asterisk, which is going to give us all of the models being shared in, and we're going to replace that with shared space asterisk. So the share name will now be the source model name with a shared prefix. And we can select add. And then in the tins tab, we can select our survey tin. And again, we'll search for asterisk and replace with shared space asterisk and select add and finish. Uh, now the, the models have been shared into the client project. We can select our plus button. And there you can see all of the models uh, and tins that are available to be shared in. 
or that have been shared in and are available available to be added to the view. Uh, we'll just go ahead and add all of these models on. Select Add. So you can see that those models have come through. And we can select Add on our perspective view and select our tin. Now you notice that these models are now blue, which indicates that they have been shared into, into this project via another project. Select Add on our tin. And there you can see that our tin has come through as well. Uh, so that's the basics of sharing. Uh, you are able to change the colors uh, in the model lists uh, away from orange and blue if you like. And that is controlled by environment variables. Uh, you can change these environment variables through project management env.4d and navigate to projects sharing. And these three color boxes here are for the color uh, in the list boxes for elements shared in, elements shared out, and elements shared in and out. So the only one we haven't seen here is the element shared in and out, and that will have a default uh, purple color. Uh, so in the future videos in this series, we'll be covering uh, the additional environment variables that you can see in this panel, as well as covering uh, additional ways of sharing within 12D model.